Hi people, how are you doing? This video is about the app that's spying on us. We uh, are basically all living in a surveillance state. London has over a million cameras in the street, I think, and we have surveillance apps on our phones. There are several system apps, Android system apps, that are installed by Google without our permission. All of them combined do the following nasty things. They scan all your images. They can use your camera and your microphone to spy on you without you even knowing it. They um, track your location. They store that in the cloud. They uh, track your behavior. And the app we're talking about today is controlling your encrypted keys. It's called Android System Key Verifier. And supposedly it is um, making Telegram and WhatsApp and banking apps more secure. Well, WhatsApp, especially Telegram, are highly encrypted apps that can take care of themselves. That's why nobody can read your messages that way. Now there's an app that controls these keys and basically can send them anywhere. So if that ends up in the hands of, of the government or anybody, anybody else, now they can read your messages. Okay, does this sound secure to you? Uh, well, at least for me, <laughs> it's not secure at all. It's the opposite. And if you're uh, having the same opinion and you'd rather get rid of this app, then let me show you how to uninstall it. All right, let's do this quickly. You can always go back if I'm going too fast for you. Click on settings on your home screen. Scroll down to apps somewhere at the bottom. And there I see the app already. If you don't see it, then if you're on Android 14, click on these three lines here and activate system apps. Okay, find the app. There it is, Android system key V, it says. Well, that's the one. If you see this little logo, then you're right. Click on it, open it. Scroll down a little bit, deny its internet access, mobile data, click on it and switch this off. Go back, do the same with battery, it's optimized now, we put it on restricted. And now you can just uninstall the app. And click on OK to uninstall and you're done, this is it. If you regret this, then you go to apkmirror.com and you can reinstall the app from there. See you in my next video. Please like and subscribe people. I need uh, a few more subscribers to get to a thousand. Thank you.